here. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> uh, I can't talk to you now because I'm going to El Mexico. <laughs> morning. They do this every year. It's literally like six o'clock in the morning. Rise and shine. <laughs> oh literally. And we're at the airport a full two hours early. Because we might be millennials and we're boomers at heart. <laughs> Rachel scheduled our lift for 5.30 this morning. No, five, I did. I scheduled it between 5.35 and 5.50. And the guy was very prompt and got there right at 5.30. So we're here. I don't actually know if you can hear us, so we'll wait. We'll tell you where we're going in just a minute. Okay, we're seated now. Extremely tired. We're trying to wake up a little I'm bit. I'm kind of like not tired, but I know I'm going to like hit a wall here. I'm, I'm tired. Probably in two hours. I will Rachel's become, energy is keeping me high though. In two hours, I will become a cranky little girl and require a nap and chalky milk. And Dakota will have to provide. <laughs> well, we have a butler where we're going. So we're going to Thailand. To, we're going to Mexico. <laughs> oh <my God>. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to Mexico. Mexico. Vamos a la playa. A mi me gusta baila. Vamos a la noche. Sounds of fiesta. That's going to be us. <laughs> yes, so why are we going? Because I apparently am really good at my job and I hit my sales goal, so I am in what they call President's Club. So they are sending me to Mexico for free with a plus one. Insert plus one right Insert here. Insert plus one to kick back and relax and just like live the wealthy life that God intended for me to live it just didn't pan out the way he intended but we'll talk about that later yeah so we're going for like two and a half days and we get a butler and we're gonna be at the pool all the whole time and we get a pillow menu fun fact the pillow menu so you call the front desk and you tell them like I'll sleep in my stomach and they're like we're bringing you a stomach sleeping pillow there's literally a menu different pillow I had to google it they have but there's menus of different pillow of varieties and there's like a jacuzzi in the room and on the balcony on the balcony and yeah all inclusive we're eating and drinking as if this is our last I'm time probably on gonna earth gain 30 pounds but like honestly like there's worse things in the world worth it kim there's people that are dying <laughs> just brought me along because i keep up with her keep my dad her, her boogie woogie woogie <laughs> her boarding passes and where we're sitting on the plane and when we need to I don't know learn. anything. I'm just kind of following her when I get there. <laughs> You're my dad. Boogie woogie woogie. We'll get sick. I'm not, I'm not getting the coronavirus. <laughs> Once again, ladies and gentlemen. It's like people running. <laughs> not walking. Ah! <laughs> get a little car sick and Rachel's making fun of me for sitting in the front of the bus. Nerd. <laughs> it's, just like, it's all fun and games until someone throws up on somebody. I've sat in the back of every bus I've ridden in since kindergarten and I'm not about to stop that trend at 26 years old in Cancun, Mexico. Cerebro is brain, el cabello is head, or it's for Cabeza. flip, Cabeza. cabezo is Cabeza. head. I am un poco... Un pollo loco is crazy chicken. Un poco loco is crazy chicken. <laughs> pollo. Pollo. Maybe it's crazy rooster then. Some type of poultry. What? What? Data Roman has turned off. You can enable Data. Okay. Okay. What else? Other, um, um, todos los verano. Mi familia y yo vamos a la playa. Is that your only Spanish um, I had sentence to, that you have memorized? I had to give a Spanish presentation for my third Spanish that I actually passed that time. And I wanted to go to the bars that night. And I was like, I'll only go out the night before my presentation if I recite this as many times as I can at the bar. And I went to Pantana Bob's Pool Hall in Raleigh. 
and drank about 19 too many screwdrivers and literally was reciting that to the bar, getting rounds of applauses, woke up, went to my presentation, made 100 on my presentation. You're a regular bilingual. Bilinguist. I'm bilingual. See. 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 Oh, We're here. Here. I'm gonna wipe my hands in this, I guess. Be cool. All photogram. No, they're not for real. They're moving. Look at them all. Oh, he just went first one. What if one eats one of the fishes? And I see us, I'm like, look, oh, there he is. Drink in Mexico? Cheers. Not alcoholic, because we're really 15 years Cheers. old at heart. Cheers. <laughs> yes. I'm a no. Oh, let's go. I'm a no. <laughs> My name is Rachel Carnegie at Loud Hot Blonde on Instagram. Follow me because I'm a clout chaser. Welcome to my crib. My sugar daddy bought me this entire beautiful Mexican condo unit. And today I'm going to show you what I call home. Follow me. I mean, it's a little bit shabby, but I don't mind living in poor conditions. So first is my rundown shabby bathroom. Clearly there's a lot of updates need to be needed. I really wouldn't live in a place that looks poor like this to begin with, but not everyone is able to be rich. <laughs> Let me show you my favorite part, the balcony. This is what it is to be wealthy. When you have a big trust fund and you're a family rich like me, you will have a pool on your balcony. Sorry, some of you can't relate. Maybe one day you can. <laughs> this is my view. Multi-million dollar. Trust fund baby. Rich. Not poor. Not ever going to be poor. I will never not not be poor. Not not with well, how she goes. She goes. <laughs> This is um, my reenactment from Big Little Lies. I will never not not be rich. <laughs> That's the actual reaction. Hey, I won a little work adventure. I've got a whole purse to literally just carry my room key and potentially my phone if I need it. Rachel's got a cute head scarf, hair scarf. Why did you tie my straps? Looking fab. One of the perks of being good at your job at the President's Club is free sunglasses for you and your friends. <laughs> Wait, what you just say about your dessert? Tastes like the fair. <laughs> Tastes like the fair. <laughs> oh no, if God doesn't give you anything, you can't. <laughs> Which is why you have to eat all the dessert and deal with your stomach ache later. <laughs> Um, I don't care about that. I care about this. <laughs> Hashtag my Super Bowl. <laughs> Y'all know I'm freaking out right now. Through all loan programs, our university becomes worse. Our campus, wherever you are. It's day two. It's a little cloudy, show you what it, but it's still beautiful. And it's like, like the perfect temperature. We're waiting on our breakfast to arrive to our rooms. These are my free sunglasses because I look really tired. But even though I got like 12 hours of sleep last night. Um, but yeah, this is our bathtub out on the balcony. 
I'm just waiting on Rachel. We're waiting on our breakfast to arrive. I think I said that. And then we're gonna go down and probably get some more breakfast and find our place by the room. Oh, I think it's here. Yeah. Yeah. Day two of Mexico. I'm not well, but I'm also not unwell. So we're like a good, <laughs> healthy mix of where you should be out of Mexico. True. Like the resort location? Well, no, like where we're going. We are going to breakfast with my friend Emily and Heather. Morning. Hi, morning. morning. Heather used to work at Channel Advisor, but now she no longer does. Emily still works with me. <laughs> we have a great time. Um, we are going to breakfast and we're getting detox juice because your girl had about five too many vodka pineapples, but that's the point of vacation. Um, and then we're just gonna kind of do that song, dance again all day through the day today. This is our private pool. This is our honey home. By America. It was great while I was there. The beach is that way. Lunch is over there. Phone eats first, phone always eats first. If you didn't grab your meal, did you even eat up? Oh You're so annoying. No, I'm not. I'm a tried and true millennial slash Gen Zer who is very aware of the social media and our climate today. So I've decided that Miami Vices are, that's my drink of choice for sure. Mm. Okay, I'm not sure how much of this you'll hear, but we're out on the beach doing pictures because it's so beautiful. And I just wanted to show you what it looks like. Rachel is my most extra friend, so it works out really well because then there's no amount of photos that we can't take. Honestly, the limit of pictures we can take doesn't exist. Look how good my... This light is so good <laughs> Oh, oh, wait, wait, we just so fantastic. <laughs> And that Good for us. is how Instagram content is made. It's a lot, but when you post to the gram and get that instant gratification, it's worth it. Trust me. I'm 26 years old. I know what I'm talking about. And I'm making a yearbook this year, so. Sushi tonight. <laughs> or, or um, black tar. Yeah, we ordered the, their vegetables, but they kind of look um, a little crispy. <laughs> I'm gonna eat some wontons. What is this, crusty vegetables? I'll eat crusty vegetables. The one marker on black is ponzu, and the white one is just plain soy sauce. Oh, perfect. Still working on your Coca-Cola? Um, no, I'm, I'm done, you can take it. May I get some more water? Day. Three? Second first day. Oh my god. 
this is this is actually pretty realistic of what life looks like with no more black coffee for me. We're on our way to get breakfast. Ah, uh, my body is screaming. It and says some... he needs fiber and he's kale. You are not 18. You are 26. Give me nourishment. We're getting towels. And we're gonna get some detox juice. Oh, we need to get towels. I don't. You would think I would know the routine by now. Detoxified juice. Different. Yeah. I'm not well. I'm well at the moment, but after drinking these, I'm going to uh, be well-ish. This okay. is like, yeah, that's like, mm. that's nice. Oh my god, that's so good. Yeah. Mm. That's good. Sporty. Sauce green. Hola. The bar's open. The bar's open. It doesn't open until 11, so we, we struggle, struggle <laughs> until 11 a.m. Eastern time. But Miami Vice Pina Colada coming right up. Mm -hmm. That's cute. Reach. Three, pull out like this. So ready? Right. One, One, two, two three. three. And then back in? Yeah. So this is what it looks like. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to do two walks to the table. Okay. <laughs> Are we gonna order food now? Absolutely. Yeah. I'm um, ready. Listen, honey, I'm gonna get the burger. How would you like? Honey, I'm gonna get the burger. Um, like medium, medium, medium. Medium, medium. <laughs> medium, medium. Medium. Yes. Baby, um, medium. medium. It's very special because we we'll put one fried egg in the top. It's I so think bad. that's great for me. It's Protein. a good journey for you. <laughs> if you see me looking snatched later, it's because I had a fried egg. <laughs> yes, <laughs> work it. Yes, honey. <laughs> I love it. Salt and pepper. Huh? Um, like, with the tomatoes? Yes. No, yes. no, no crickets. No jalapenos. And no jalapenos. Why not? Jalapenos on the side. I yeah. can't handle Onion. jalapenos. Crickets are great protein. Yeah, they are. No, that's an aphrodisiac. Oh, oh. Cilantro. Cilantro. Yeah. Oh, yeah, pack that in. Well, <laughs> yes, Careful. give me like a cilantro salad. Yeah, cilantro. It's the easy one. See, other people are eating it too. <laughs> Oh, I don't love. Oh, that guy. Yes. Yes. Dame, 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 dame. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. That glove. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, what's going on? That glove's going to be nice. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Squirt a little bit. Oh, my God. Nothing like fried pork grains like guacamole. Mm. French fries, because you know. Tuna. Tuna. Hamburguesa. Hamburguesa. Hamburguesa is mi cerebro. Cactus salad. It's like 10 o'clock at night, and we're importing all of our Mexico photos because I need something to post on Instagram. And also, we have to be up at Three o'clock in the morning. Actually, I'm waking up at 3.30 because I do everything last minute and there's nothing that just really gets me going in the morning than the anxiety of missing a flight. Yeah. This is our last night in our little bed with our aquarium. Headboard. Headboard. Honestly, if you don't have an aquarium headboard, you're poor and I need you to stay within a hundred yard radius away from me. But as we were going through these pictures, we just, you know, it's all the I make a lot the of scenes. I make a lot of faces in Dakota's pictures that I honestly make in real life and I see them and I'm like, that's the face I've made in this specific situation in my life. Yeah. So, hold on. Wait. We have to show you the Instagram, Instagram stories. stories. Okay. When I go up to the bar, this is my face when I say, can I have another vodka water pineapple, please? <laughs> And then when the bartender says, ma'am, this is your 15th vodka water pineapple. And I look at him with this face like, <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh, my God. Like, I told you I could finish it. Amazing. Me preparing to order my first vodka water pineapple of the day slash new bartender so there's no shame. This <laughs> is another one of my favorites from the trip. Um, when you're trying to be fabulous, but no one's paying you any attention. <laughs> that is a mood like more times than not, just because I try to be a fabulous person, but I'm a very big personality. So a lot of times people just quit giving me any mind because I'm probably just like overwhelming that point. I get it. 
I know how it is, but I'm not sorry for who I am. It's, she was waiting for me so that we could take this this picture. Oh, my God. Freaking precious. I just don't understand how we are so cute. It's, like, so cute. Thank you, Mom and Dad, for giving me the genetics that I have because <laughs> I don't know what it feels like to be ugly. Oh I just don't want to know that feeling. <laughs> if anything, it's a burden being this insanely gorgeous because – I just, people just think I'm so beautiful. On days I'm not on with my beauty, I feel like I'm letting them down. Oh my God. Okay, it's 3.30 in the morning. I look like it's 3.30 in the morning. Hi, Mexico. Okay, if you wake up at 3.30, if you get all rose. Reach. Okay.